Have you received any negativity or heard anything from fans and across the country over some of the political comments that you've made? Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Every single person has agreed with everything <laughs> I've said. I know that's not I true. I get flowers. <laughs> I know that's I get, not true, but... I get trinkets and gifts. Well, well, just as you would expect, a little bit of both, right? A lot of both. You think, of has any of it crossed a line to, targeted, you know, at you? Sure, sure. How do you, re, how do you react? Do you just ignore it? Uh, you know, I, I, I would choose not to really respond to what I do or don't do. Uh, but I do read everything, and I try to respond. It takes time because there's a lot of letters. But uh, the only ones I don't respond to are the ones that are so courageous in their negativity that there's no address. <laughs> Just comments. That's hard to respond to. But there are people who responded and you know disagree and say why and it's erudite and intelligible and you know yeah you got a point. Those people deserve to be. Uh, written back, so I try. I probably won't get them all, but I try. Are you are you heartened by the response? Uh, both. You know, some responses uh, make you wonder what country you live in, and other responses make you very hopeful. Uh, but there's a whole lot of more hopeful than, my gosh, you know, how did this person come up with this? So overall, it, it renews my feeling that uh, something can be done uh, because there are enough people willing to listen and feel and compromise. Coach, this is not about.